what he needed to do. So now we've got uh, Magomedov up against uh, Masahiko Tomouchi. Tomouchi, you remember, disposed of uh, Avisa Scheinman uh, over in this corner, and Scheinman was very slow to get up, having to get his breath back after he'd been buried by Tomouchi with a huge Uchimata. Left him breathless. I think everyone who's done judo before knows what that feeling's like to hit your back, have the uh, the wind absolutely driven out of you. Look at the size of the crowd up there now. <laughs> no idea where they came from, but when this party kicks off this afternoon, there's going to be a lot of noise in here. We're looking forward to um, the four o'clock start. Sorry, the four o'clock semi-final block. Oh, I think there's going to be quite a party. Magomedov and Tomouchi. Aaron, I haven't asked you about your your background, your family's background, and I assume that there is a uh, Japanese on your father's side, is that correct? Uh, yeah, well, there's Japanese on both sides. Okay, mom too? Yes, mom too. All right, what was your mother's maiden name? What was, uh, uh, you're going to get a slap if you can't remember <laughs> when you get home. <laughs> it's uh, Takaki. Okay, Takaki and um, Kunihiro. So, and dad, was he a judo man or? Uh, yeah, Dad was a judo man. That's how I got into judo. Well, I blame your dad, then, eh? Uh, what about Mom? She was safely out of that, then. Uh, I think so. I think maybe she did it for a little bit when she met him. Right. But I, uh, nothing serious like me. And what about um, y y your father and judo? Was he in involved in the U.S., or have they been in the U.S. for a while, or...? Uh, yeah, they. Because I mean, you're a, you're born and bred in yeah, the U.S. I'm, yeah, I'm born and bred in the U.S. I think they were both born there too. Right. So it's a long history of um, your family in the U.S. and it would have all the judo would have been done in the U.S. Yep. Yep. Well, I have to say that the U.S., Canada, and Brazil, they've managed whenever there's been a um, a move from Japan to these countries, US, Canada, and Brazil. They've kept up the traditions, and lots of youngsters have gone into judo. It's not necessarily the case in some places in Europe. We've got a number of um, youngsters who've got Japanese backgrounds in the UK, for example, and they don't seem to, um, to carry it over. I'm not sure why. They all get involved in football and rugby and different things, you know, but uh, it's nice to see Uchimata oh. attack. Well, that started um, too far off the era for it to count. Magomedov is going to count himself lucky because I think he could have been on the um, the end of an ip on there. That could have counted. Magomedov just out of camera, breathing a bit heavily and moving slowly back onto the tatami to take his place back in the contest. Tamauchi leads by Yuko. Dropping down and attempting the... Uh, looked as though he wanted to uh, get involved in some kind of kataguruma, but way too far away. Tamauchi saw it coming and blocked that. Well, Flavio Canto's out, Takamatsu's out. Your man, Stevens, really needs to get past, past Nifontov. He's the stumbling block. But he does that, and I tell you what, if he beats Nifontov, we could hear the Star Spangled Bla Banner today. I know it seems like a long way off, but the man's one win away from the final. We don't want to put the um, the damper on it or jinx him, but you've got to look ahead, haven't you? And um, nobody was looking past 
Takamatsu and no one is really looking past Nifontov. We've got to concentrate on Stevens and Nifontov. Here, Tomouchi leads and he's gone further ahead now. Magomedov going backwards here. Tomouchi beginning to look more and more comfortable. Amy Cotton has just uh, lost on map four, lost out to Stephanie Possumai, the, uh, the French girl. Unfortunate. I like Amy, she works hard and very, very tough competitor, but the French girls are a real handful. Maybe they, they can just have a chat with each other in French because uh, I know Amy speaks French, <laughs> the Quebecois. So with a minute and a half left, it's the Japanese Tomouchi who leads by Wazari. Makomedov struggling a bit here. He looks to have run out of ideas with regard to how to handle or how to deal with Tomouchi. Uchimata attack, but it didn't even look as though it troubled him. Oh, how cute was that? <laughs> Uchimasa and then following it up with a leg grab. Tomouchi looks as though he's just in a randori session here, doesn't he? Look at Magomedov, he's looking up and thinking, what am I going to do with this guy? Uh, I think this is a good example of what we talked about when I first came, how we talked about the styles and posture. This is a good example. Tomouchi has good posture. He has that Japanese lovely balance, shiro. yeah. And Magmedov kind of does the bent over the weird yeah. style of judo, yeah. and it's not working. And it's not working against um, Tomouchi. He looks ever more comfortable. His movement, his grip changes, posture changes as well. You know, just too much for Magomedov. He looks clueless now, I'm afraid. Goes for the left Uchimata, but easily blocked. Just drops the hips and pushes him out. He didn't even try to get off it. He just he knew it wasn't coming. There's the right Uchimata from Tomouchi. That doesn't work, and Magomedov collapses to the mat. And with 20 seconds left, when you begin to collapse to the um, tatami, with 20 seconds left, you know you've got nothing left. No steam. Power's gone. Magomedov's looking at his coach and saying, get the shower ready. I'm on my way. <laughs> One last throw of the dice there from Magomedov. But it's all over. Yep. Masahiko Tomouchi takes it from Sirahudzin Magomedov. His name's too long to um to fit in on all the um the space that we've got, but <laughs> I assure you it is. The crowd beginning to get worked up about something. Uh, it could be the fact that um, who's coming on here? Is it Vicente or Elias? It must be the Brazilian. Here they come. Well, I can see Axel Clejre, Clejre of France. Yeah, and it is the Brazilian, Elias. So. Another roll of the dice for the for the um, Brazilians. <laughs> 